All right, we're gonna see how far you could shoot a Taurus judge today. We got the uh, public defender polymer, and we got the uh, six inch barrel here. We're gonna be shooting uh, 45 Colt. And my orange steel gong there. It's a 16 inch steel gong. Right now it's at 50 yards. And we're just gonna keep walking it out until we can't hit it no more. Or until we run out of ammo. <laughs> so, just to give you an idea. That's what we're looking at right there. As you can see, oops. <laughs> 50 yards, the uh, target, I see that one's better because it's a longer sight radius. It's about the same size there, but it's definitely going to be harder with that little one with the closer sight radius because the sight is already twice the size of 50 yards as the target. This one's the same. But at 100 yards, it's going to be dinky. So this is what we're shooting. 250 grain. It's a cowboy load. Low recoil. That's all we could find today. 750 feet per second, which actually we just did a velocity test with the judges and a 410 shotgun. And even with the six inch barrel, these were still coming in at less than that. So they're going to drop like a turd out there. <laughs> all right, now this on the pistol range oops, is shooting several inches high. So I'm just going to aim at the bottom of that target, hopefully still hit it. It might go over it. That went just under, didn't it? Didn't see. Looked like it was just under, so I think it's about dead on at 50. So this one will aim center mass. Went way left. Try two more since I only had three in there. Maybe that was me. Get a good shot here. I think you're right earlier that it does shoot a little left. That one was just left, so I'm going to aim at the right side of it. It's also about half a target high from there. That last shot was at the bottom. Those are all over the place. So I think we're done with this one. Hopefully, we do better with the six inch here. Or we're done. <laughs> <laughs> I think this six, uh, six inch will do a lot better though. Those were kind of erratic too. It was just kind of all over the place. Aside from being consistently left. Well, we did pretty good at 50. I mean, I didn't even really have to try hard, so I'm going to skip 75 and just go ahead and go out 100. And I'm going to try to put that dirt back around there so we can, you know, if we miss, we know how to walk it. All right, so now we're at 100 yards. And I got that dirt road behind it, so if I miss, we'll see where so I can adjust. Was it low left? Looked like it. Ah, just missed it. Just over, right? Yep.
I think it's still straight. It's just definitely low from there, obviously. So I'm gonna find the hold point. All right, well, I found where to hold. Basically just a hair over the top. Hundred yards. And these are low power. Is this low? Yep. One more, just for good measure. Now one that just went low, I was a little lower. Yep. If you get the right release and the right aim point, that's a hit every time at 100 yards, so. You try a few. Were you using the bag? No. I was just, yeah, like that. Just right? I didn't see it. Yeah, it was definitely high. Yeah, you're a foot high. Yeah. Try two more. Make sure you get good release. Yep. There you go. Just left, maybe a hair low. Yeah. Might as well go ahead and use those last three. All right. Give me three hits. <laughs> just over? I did not see that one. I think it was just over. That was just over. Yeah. yeah. You get a good release. And uh, hold steady. It'll hit that target every time, 100 yards. If we had more, I'd take it out to 150, but that's going to be it for today.